Hi, I'm Madeline with Vision Earth Channel, and we're here at the Raw Odyssey Festival at Hippocrates Health Institute, and I'm here today with Nicole. How are you? I'm excellent. How are you? Very good. So what brought you out here today? What brought me out here? I just recently launched a line of raw, vegan, organic, almost sugar-free, salt-free, chocolate-free chocolates. And they should be selling them soon at the Hippocrates store. So this is just a first venue. This is a really unofficial launch of the product. Other than Hippocrates, are you going to have your own website? Or are you going to be, I don't know, distributing anywhere else? We have a website currently. Um, just the home page is up. It's millomade.com, M-I-L-O made.com. And you can follow us on Twitter or Instagram at Milo underscore made. And we are going to be distributing. We've had a lot of attention here and a lot of the, just at the show today, people offering to help us with the distribution. But as for now, we really, the company is six days old. Oh, wow. Very just new. Very new. We just formed in, really in the last week from sort of concept to packaging, mm -hmm. making the products, getting here. So it's been a bit of a rush, but we made it. The base for all of the flavors are organic raw uh, carob, mm -hmm. organic raw coconut, mm -hmm. organic alcohol-free vanilla, maca, chlorella, and spirulina. And then in addition to those ingredients, we have an orange crisp flavor, which has sprouted dehydrated buckwheat and orange. We have a coconut almond flavor, chia and buckwheat, mm -hmm peanut butter, mm. and we have an everything flavor, which has um, coconut, buckwheat, almonds, golden raisins, and cranberries. Yum. And I have here for you the almond flavor to try. I'm so, so excited to try this right now. I, mean, I, could, I have to admit, my mouth is watering just a little bit. <laughs> Let's try this out. Tear it open and get in there. Yeah. All right. Mm. It's amazing. And there's less than one third of a gram of sugar. Wow. Per serving, so it's, it's and not you would sugar never free, know. Amazing stuff. The coconut flavor is very strong. I love that about it. So definitely check them out, Milo Made, milomade.com. So you were telling me a little bit that you tried the program, right? Yes. I originally went to film school and then law school, and I took back-to-back -to -back bar exams, and I was feeling a little under the weather and just lethargic, and my mother had... I, the first time I came to Hippocrates was actually in 1989. It was really little. I just came for like one day to visit my mom. She's come back a few times because my grandmother has osteoporosis, and that's how she knew about Hippocrates. So she suggested rather than going to like some kind of a health spa, we come here where you actually learn about health and nutrition. So I came and I did the program. I fell in love with the people, the staff, the Clements, you know, the director. Um, the energy here is just like nothing else. And I knew I wanted, I knew I needed more, and I wanted to come back. So I decided to do the nine-week health educator program. And so I'm a graduate from the Hippocrates Health Educator Program. Thank you. And that's actually where this idea was born. Um, and after, even after the nine-week program, I still wanted more. So I stayed and I did a two-week internship in the kitchen. So I learned a lot about raw food preparation. And really, I had no culinary experience, so that was, yeah. that was it. You learned a lot. I learned a lot. So tell me a little bit, like before um, switching your diet to after like the program, like, tell me the before and after, how do you feel? Well, I've always been, or so I thought, a very clean eater. Mm -hmm. And after you come to Hippocrates, you realize even the healthiest of people are not very healthy at all. Mm -hmm. My whole life, I've been vegetarian with periods of pescatarian, so I ate fish sometimes. But even being vegetarian or vegan, you can still be really unhealthy. At Hippocrates, they teach you the importance of food combining and just the, the benefits of all the of, of being raw. So for instance, you can be vegan and have you know 
to put tomatoes on your salad. That impedes digestion. Yeah. And you can have almonds, and they're cooked, mm -hmm. but, but not soaked. Let's say if you soak them overnight, it releases enzyme inhibitors, which are imperative for health. Mm -hmm. So they really teach you all these things um, that the average person doesn't know. And you were saying that your mom came here because of the osteoporosis. How did that, did it help her, the program at all? Yeah, well, it's my grandmother who lives in England who has osteoporosis. And she came here for the first time in 1989. And she's right now 89 years old. And she follows the program pretty strict. And it has helped her. You know, you think that drinking milk, you get calcium. It actually, you know, these products, dairy pulls calcium from your bone, so it's kind of counterintuitive. You think that what you're doing is right, but you're actually really hurting yourself. Um, whereas, you know, pea shoots and sunflower sprouts are packed full of protein, and they're vegan. So it's amazing. You learn the proper way to get. So why don't you tell us the website again? Where can we find you? You can find the product at milomade.com. M-I-L-O-M-A-D-E dot com. Perfect. Thank you so much for taking the time and speaking with us today, Nicole. Thank you. It was my pleasure. You've been watching the Vision Earth channel. Thank you.